guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play the Evil Within. I hate you so much, I haven't pulled the game out. I'm sick of waiting for you and your shitty attitude. You know what? You suck. You know what? You suck even more. You wake me up. An hour late. <laughs> I didn't wake you up an hour early. I said late. I did not wake you up an hour late either. You woke yourself up an hour late. Oh. Wait, what? I don't even know what's going on. No, I woke you up at the correct time. I said 10 o'clock my time. And it's 10 o'clock my time right now. Yeah, but you failed to think about the time difference. Why is it my job to think about the time difference? Because I didn't know you went through a time change. Fucking, it, it's the same time it's been every year, Alicia. What? Yeah, in England. Well, we've known each other for three years. That's three years now. You should have worked out this stuff by now. <laughs> How do you even know what day Thanksgiving is? I've been celebrating that for the past 21 years. Well, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving, so why would I care about Thanksgiving? Well, it's about to say Christmas, but I know what day Christmas is, and then Hanukkah changes every year. <laughs> so it's the next holiday. <laughs> you can't just have Hanukkah changing every year. It does. How how does it change? By the moon. Can you just go, oh, we're going to have Hanukkah on July for 30 seconds this year? No. Well, you should. It has Look, I'm gonna I fucking make you move in a minute. Gosh, I'm tired of waiting on you. Are you ready to play? Alicia, I was ready before you were even born. That's a difficult concept. Uh, Time travel, remember? More so, the game came out a few weeks ago. Time travel, remember? <laughs> Anything is possible with time travel, Alicia. I'm just gonna start playing now. You can't, I'm not ready. Oh my god, you are ready. How am I ready? I need You're to do a whole ready. intro. Oh my god. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Are you ready, actually, before I do this? Yeah. Okay, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Fear. Fear, for fuck's sake. We need to start again. <laughs> Damn it! Hello, okay. everyone. Do you want to do the intro? Because you might do a better job than me at the minute. No, because I know I want to do a British accent. <laughs> no, you have to do it now. That sounds crazy. You're, you're high, Ed. You have to do it. Oh, God. No, I'm not. Yeah. Oh. Look, stop delaying it, because we're never going to play the game at this second rate. <laughs> oh, no. We only have 43 minutes. Come on, Elise. Do the fucking intro. Hello everybody and welcome to I don't know what number we're on because I, I don't keep track. Uh, <laughs> this is oh wait hang on I'll tell you now before we start okay so the number we're on is somewhere past eighteen probably. <laughs> I didn't oh, really God. keep track. And welcome to Evil Within episode greater than seventeen. Uh, yeah, let's, let's fucking start. Uh. I don't know where you're at. Wait, what are we talking about now? What part of the game you're at? I have no oh, idea. Oh, I'm on chapter 9, last time I checked. I'm with you're on Lynn. chapter 7. How did you get so far behind? Um, Chapter 1. Oh, yeah. You're on the boss fight, aren't you? Yeah. That's good. Have on fun with that. On the boss side, I have full... I'm gonna call them stim packs. <gasps> no! You can't call them stim packs. I don't know what they're called in this game. Med kits! Needle, needle injectinators. I'm kind of sure they're not called needle injected whatever the fuck you just said. What needle injectinators? Well, what else? Are, what else are you gonna call them? Boxhead. 
He's here. You can't call them that. No, the gate just dropped down. No, 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 that's not an appropriate name. You can't go calling Bob's things Boxhead. Look, now that is just mean. Now, you know full what? well I don't have a mum anymore. Did you just crawl out of the ground? Maybe you should crawl out of the feckin' ground. Dude, I forgot how to attack. How do I attack? Uh, I'm using a computer, so... I don't... I right oh, seriously forgot how to attack. And right click. I'm assuming uh, trigger would be a good, good way to go. I'm so confused. Because I don't know if you're playing off the same uh, controls. Look, I'll make your mum play off my controls in a minute. I love the shotgun. Well, I love my pussy. That was so easy. Is that even a real thing? What do you mean? Are you on about now? He died so easy. Oh yeah, good luck with that. He's not dead, is he? They're no. giving me more ammo. You really think that's gonna be it? God damn it, I was hoping. After everything else we've been through in this game, you thought that was gonna be it. Okay, I've been up for not five minutes. <laughs> you know how hard this game has been. Uh, I dreamed a dream. Oh wait, I think, I don't remember what that's from. I'm kind of sure it's from Les Mis, which makes me regret everything. I didn't like Les Mis. But I did build a set for it, or help with a uh, stagecraft. You can't just do it. stuff like that, Alicia. It's illegal. They gave me power tools. I'll give you fucking power tools in a minute with my pussy. What the fuck? What? He just decapitated himself? Yeah. <laughs> I like my guy. Does this thing stay dead? If only. Dude, this fucking so area is complete bullshit. So you know the guy, Ruvik? Yeah. You know how he one shot kills you? Yeah. I'm in an entire area dedicated to him and he just keeps appearing and killing me. Like, I'll just do something, he'll appear, he'll kill me, and then I'll reload. Maybe he wouldn't kill you if you didn't make fun of my jacket? You never know. What's that got to do with anything? With the ridiculous hoodie. Look, you brought that jacket, you deal with it. I like this jacket. You can't just like a jacket. Why not? Black people. He's kind of like... Um... Pyramid Head's stupid younger brother. Why is he stupid? Because I'm gonna kill him. Why haven't you already killed him? Kind of, I guess. I quote. Kind of just reincarnated. You can't just, look. I'm sick of this shit that you're just putting up all the fucking time. You can't just reincarnate. Maybe you should act more bollocks. That was very British of you. Well, Ruvik's back, and I can't hide from him because he knows where I am at all times and he just kills me instantly. Hi, Ruvik. Well, I would assume he knows where you are at all times. You, you can't even hide under beds in, ward in cupboards. He just goes straight to you and kills you. He spawns, and he will spawn and kill you straight away. No questions asked. Boom, you're dead. I mean, how shocked can you be? Yeah, but this is a bit <sighs> ridiculous. He did tear down a city by looking at it. Yeah, well, I tore down my mum's oh, pussy by looking at it. You don't see me complaining. On the plus side, he only seems to spawn in the same place once. Like, 
He killed me the first time, and he never respawned in that location. So I suppose that's positive. What is this? Hello, good sirs. Sorry to interrupt your feeding, but... How do I kick? Dude, I'm having the hardest time remembering these goddamn controls. If only there was a way you could go into your options and look them all up. I'm sick of your shit, okay? I want you to know this. You chubby coon. No, Alicia. Who trapped this feckin' manor so much? Have you killed the boss yet? Like, properly killed him? Um... I'm about to pull a lever, but it looks like he's trying to get out of it one last time. Oh, he jumped up and... yeah. Oh, I died. Me. I had no idea what I was meant to shoot, so I died. Oh, I was meant to shoot that. Well, thanks for feckin' telling me, game. Dude, this game hates me right now. It's just giving you time to catch up. You said. Legitimately, this game is giving you time to catch up. I'm being fucked by Ruvik, fucked by traps, fucked by mobs. Can't even remember the fucking controls. Are you using protection? What? No. I'm disappointed. Well, how do you think you were born? You're gonna have this weird demon baby. You are the weird demon baby. Spoiler alert! <laughs> <laughs> how is that a spoiler? Chapter 7 cleared. Took you fucking none of time. Yeah, you wouldn't let me start it last time. You're like, I'm gonna end the episode! And I'm like, but I wanna play it. You can't just go around saying that it's all my fault. It makes everything easier. You don't see me bitching about you, do you? Yes. Give one example. Every example. That's illegal. I quit. Are you kidding me? This guy just cut my throat. How do you fucking melee in this game? I've legitimately forgot everything. But there's such an easy fix. Easy fix? What the feck are you on about? Look at your goddamn controls. I can't look at my goddamn controls. Why? They don't exist. How's that? Alicia, he's fucking back again, and he's gonna fucking kill me. Are you shocked? Yes. Dude, how am I meant to do this? With a rifle. He's unkillable! Freeze bolt? I'll fucking give you a fucking freeze bolt in a minute. Alicia, you and I both know he can't be shot, because he just teleports closer to you. That's why I said freeze bolt. It's still going to require shooting him, you stupid little girl. You never know. You fucking weird cripple. Hey, that was one time. One time? Yeah. I think it was more than one time, don't you? The fuck? Go through that, you little bitch. Dude, I wish there was a save point. I wish I could just save it whenever the fuck I felt like it. That would be too convenient. You don't have Ruvik one-shotting you around every flipping corner. No, but I did have a big issue on chapter one. You had a big on chapter one. Fuck you. I'm sick of you and your feckin' attitude. Oh, Alicia, guess whose uh -huh. room I'm in. I'll give you one guess. Leslie's? 
Ruvik's room. Why? Oh, are you getting backstory that we haven't gotten? Probably. I just got picked up a note on Ruvik's room in Ruvik's room. So, I mean, if I read it, I probably would have learned a lot. Oh my fucking god, the controls in this game. I forgot everything. And it's all because of you. Yeah. Everything that's ever gone wrong in my life is down to you. Okay. How does that make you feel? Pretty amazing. How does that make you feel? Exhausted. Well, I hope you fucking die of exhaustion. As you can see, I'm not in the best of moods. Because you smell. How does that make you feel? How does that make you feel? Is that all you can say? At the moment, yes. I don't think I'm mentally capable of saying anything else. I'm now climbing through a flipping chimney. It's cool, because I'm climbing through, like, an underwater lake. I'm in a safety area. I think. And there's these weird, disgusting-looking haunted. Are you sure you haven't just seen yourself? Yeah. I mean, it, for all I know, it could be a base model off me, but not quite a spitting image. How am I meant to know? This probe is way harder to insert. The first one I just sort of picked it up and put it in, this one. This one's way more complicated. I love punching barrels. Why? Because of, it's so funny how your fist can just destroy them. One shot. Well, I can destroy a lot of things in one shot. Well, good for you. Hey, this person said. Have you found out yet? No. The meaning of life. No, I'm searching a dead person who's on a spike. You can't just do that, Alicia. And I got a bloody release plate. Where the feck am I meant to insert this shit? Anyway guys, thanks for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, take care. If you've enjoyed, kill Alicia.